Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am just talking quickly about self-discipline. It is really important that we try and develop our own self-discipline because that's the only way we're going to see real lasting changes and actually make leaps and bounds in our lives to, to actually change things that we want to see changing. Um, a lot of times we... <sighs> When we try to get up, we set a routine. I, I, I go through a little routine every morning when I wake up and stuff like that. And I have become so used to it now. I become so disciplined now with this routine that it's just normal. I don't see my day feels off when I don't incorporate one or two of those uh, practices in my mornings. And to a lot of people, it seems so boring. People like discipline. Oh, that word, like discipline. Discipline is for old people or people in the army right no it's not discipline is for every one of us if we want to actually whatever it is that we want to work towards whatever it is we want to accomplish we need to have a certain level of discipline and discipline for certain things so for instance let's just say let's just say you want to become an artist let's say you know when you think of the word discipline what would you think about? You naturally would think about somebody putting in time, dedicating a certain period of time or out of their day toward art, to working towards their art, to creating works of art or to probably purchasing art supplies or gathering art supplies or looking at art, kind of like, you know, now trying to figure art out, realize what is art, like, you know, what makes art art. Those are the things that you need to remember when it comes to discipline, practicing what it is that you seek. And the universe conspires along with you, just like in the book The Alchemist, Paolo Coelho talks about the universe conspiring to work toward whatever it is that you seek, the, it's also seeking you, basically. So discipline is something that's not just for old people, not just for people who are athletes or, you know, some... <laughs> big sergeant in the military or something like that. Discipline is needed by everyone, a certain level of discipline. It's not a bad word, it's a great word. And just as simple as your diet, just as simple as, you know, what you do to feed your soul, what you do, what is your bedtime routine, all of these things require some amount of discipline. And this is what a lot of people lack in the society today because I did a video just recently on distractions, on things that poor people do that the rich don't that makes them separate, that separates them <laughs> in terms of money. But it, it separates them in terms of livelihood as well. Discipline. What disciplines do the rich have? What disciplines do they develop? versus what poor people develop. Discipline is important important in whatever whatever field you're in, whatever financial status you have, discipline is super important. And so I just wanted to do this video because a lot of times we spend time doing a lot of things that are distracting to us, that aren't helping us move toward anything at all, not just some goal, not toward anything. You're getting nowhere fast. And this is because we lack discipline. A lot of times you look at like my son, my son is 14, right? And I've just noticed now that school is closed for the summer. He's growing some level of discipline. He's got a summer job. He's going now at least four to five times out of the week, um, which I'm very proud of. And I'm seeing the discipline develop in him. He's actually getting up on a certain at a certain time. He's preparing his clothes and stuff like that. And it's wonderful to see the changes because just a couple of weeks or months ago, it was not so. Like, <laughs> he was totally out of order, totally in shambles. And I'm like, you have, you have to develop some level of discipline if you want to succeed at anything. You have to remember now, preparation is important in life. So when you are planning to go to work in the morning, you should know, okay, well, what am I going to wear? You should have some idea of what you're going to wear. The discipline comes in now when you have to go and prepare your clothes. You don't have to do it 10 minutes before you have to be to work. 
You know, you do it the night before. The discipline, because that saves you time. Suppose it rains or something the next morning happens and you can't leave on time. You're going to be super late and it's going to cost you. It can cost you to lose your job. It can cost you. So discipline is something that we all need to actually focus on and develop a little bit more in our lives. And we will see actually things, we will see things turn around so greatly. And you don't have to become disciplined to the level of some Shaolin monk or something like that. <laughs> you just, it just takes a start. Just start something somewhere, you know. Um, you can even say, I'm going to read a chapter of a book every night. Or, and I don't mean just pick up any random book either and read it. Like, <laughs> it could be, it make it something that's going to teach you something. Something that's touching for you. Something that you're passionate or interested in, you know. So I just wanted to do this quick video today for you guys because... You know, I like to talk about progressive things. I like to talk about stuff that is, that are going to help move our lives forward and make us start thinking more successfully. Let's think more like successful, the rich people that we are. We don't think, we don't think like the others, you know. We have to think differently. We have to think and see differently from our mind's eye what we want. And that's the discipline as well. Discipline disciplining your mind to see what you want to see in the future, what you want to create, what you want to like have, what you want to maintain, what you want to grow. The image that you see, you have to have the discipline to maintain that image in your mind because we have so many, so many sources of stimuli and I mean they're super stimuli, like stimuli, like just like that, like your eyes, your attention is diverted somewhere else, right? So the discipline is super important to, for us to practice because the system is meant to distract us all day long, all day, all day. And if we don't notice that and have the discipline actually to kind of now divert our attention, our attention away from those nonsense and <laughs> focus on the things that we want, you're never going to see changes, man. And I want, I'm about change, so, you know. Thanks for watching though. I want you to let me know, you know, what you think of this video. Like and subscribe to my channel because I talk about a lot of positive things. I talk about things that people may consider them to be boring. But guess what? One day, they're going to come back to that video. They're going to come back. They're going to say, you know something? Serenity Esoteric Empish just talked about this. I just saw this like, you know, okay, yeah, I really need to start working on myself. That's what... I want <laughs> that's what we need we need more positive truth to be told we need to like wake up to the truth and stop lying to ourselves stop kidding ourselves stop being immature stop acting like kids now it's time for us to put on your big boy pants and become adults the successful strong adults that we are okay <laughs> So, like I said, give me some feedback. Let me know. Keep it positive, though. That's what I'm all about here. And peace, love, and blessed be.